Hi there and welcome back to Aliens vs Predator 2. I'm Baron. And here we have the waiting to tiny debriefing the incident appendix 1 scientific journals. Tripatorian is the warrior of the hive, though massive and ferocious. However, she is born quite humbly. Under the right pheromone conditions, runners and drones undergo a molting process extending over several years. During this time, the xenomorphic sin thickens and hardens. As the Praetorian enters mid-phase, it emits its own behavioral pheromone, which in turn enrages the hive. Most Praetorians die during this phase. Once strong enough to escape, will wander the surrounding environs until her shell completes its hardening. Then, with a skin capable of reflecting small arms fire and the temper to match, she will return to assert her presence in the hive. Okay, bay number 2 system is damaged. We have to go to bay 3, go to bay 3 to contact Verloc for evac. Let's do that. Shit. What's that? Okay. Yeah, we got some armor back. Which way do we have to go? Hell yes, a smart gun. Oh, that's the flamethrower. That's the smart gun. Yes, sirree, I want that. I already had that actually, but hey. Awesome. Hey, friends. Oh, shit. Not good. Does that mean I'm too late? You come in if you want some. Locked. Locked. Okay, let's go down here. That's locked too. Sorry? You were saying? It's pretty dark in here. Guess we have to go down that corridor here. And up that ladder. Interesting. Hey! Marines! Find a minigun to kill Praetorians. 
Well, guess what? You're still alive. Are we gonna get out of here, sir? They're still coming. Keep them coming, buddy. Keep them coming. If you override the security system, I can contact your ship. Okay, that's what we're going to do then. Not funny. Hell yes! The minigun fires high caliber ammunition ideal for eliminating armor targets such as the Praetorians. It is also good for chewing up people, predators and drones. Use alt fire to pre-spin the gun's barrel. Okay. What else do we have here? I'm contacting the Verloc now. I guess that's good, right? There's a dropship inbound from the Verloc. ETA 15 minutes. Make sure that landing bay is clear of Xenomorphs. Clear the Bay of Alien Contamination. Alright. Whoa! That's a big fucker. Oh. Do I have to go down here? I guess so, since the elevator is shut. And that door's still locked. Okay. Ale yup. What's that? Hey, I can hack that. We. A sniper rifle. Yeah, but it's not really useful because most of the aliens are too fast for the sniper rifle. To get a clear shot, so which way? This way or that way? Where? Shit, it's dark. Let the battery reload. It's probably somewhere above us. Shit. That was no fun at all. Okay. Feeling better again. Where is his friend? Careful that the dropship doesn't drop on you. That's its death. Hooray!
Frosty, but he's weak. Tomiko. I've done a little research. I'll feed you the coordinates of a viable entry site. It's your best bet for finding your team. Mother says the schematics show an emergency landing bay near the pods. Can you get there? I'm still uploading. Get your team. Then get me. I'm coming back for you, Tomiko. You'd better. You should have a visual in a few minutes. You've got an escape plan, right? Yeah. Down the main lift, across the canyon floor, through a gate, and up an elevator to the auxiliary landing bay. I can get there in ten minutes. Ten minutes? Easy. The X is... The Exosuit is a mobile weapons platform ideal for urban warfare and house-to-house -house combat. The Exosuit carries a laser and a flamethrower in its left arm and on its right carries a rocket launcher and a minigun. You can select its arms using the next weapon and previous weapon blah blah blah. Okay. Waiting to tiny debriefing the incident appendix H com logs. Listen Harrison, I'm sending you down the old synthetic access system. It dates from the first studies before the hive learned to tear the synths to pieces. I'm pretty sure Eisenberg sent his synths down through one of these thoroughways, so the equipment ought to work. If your team is heading up, they'll be coming this way. If they're headed down, mm, just hope they're headed up. Once you find them, head up to the surface and I'll coordinate the dropship evac. Good luck. And we have to locate our team. Alright. So now we're actually running around in an exosuit, mech like. Uh, but you I don't have a flashlight here. There's no such thing. Why do you have. We have two guns. Uh, two. That's you know, Machine gun. Rockets. Both are limited. Here we have flamethrower. And laser. Fuel is limited. The laser recharges. So, let's go down here. Can't see much, but I hope there's a ledge over here. There is. All right. What's that? I guess that's harmless. Well, those are not. Where did you come from? those synths or humans? Probably synths, I'd say. Oh, you have to charge the system. Alright, that appears to be an elevator. So too. Where's the exit? Oh, here. On the other side. You've gotta be kidding me, man. All right. Moving on. How about we slay them all? Sounds like a plan? I'd say it sounds like a plan.
Let's see what we get here. To destroy the alien infestation to restart the pilot technology. Okay, let's see whether we can do that. Leave me in fucking peace. Well, I'm not hitting. Great. Maybe it's better with this. Hey, fuck it. Okay. That works too. I think we're making progress here. So we have to destroy those little arms that are blocking the machine. Always be on the lookout for some aliens. Interesting. Okay. Looks like this one is working. Let's move on. Whoa. Are you done now? No. Well, that gate apparently still is closed. Anybody trying to sneak up on us? No. Let's walk down that path then. The flamethrower really is handy against those annoying little bugs. You gotta be kidding me, man. Fine. Let's take the other one. I want to blow those things up. If it's not too much for you to handle. Thanks. Anybody trying to sneak up on us? No. It's pretty difficult to see actually. You always have to be on the lookout. Alrighty. Uh, yeah, don't fall down there, that would be instant death. So now that passage here has opened. What the fuck is going on here? Yeah, I'm having trouble on my end too. I 
I'm sick now. Die. Alright, it doesn't recharge when the other weapon is active. I wasn't aware of that. Fine. Can we please move on now? done now? How many times do I have to do that? Okay, I think that's it. No, wait. Um, what? Okay. Waiting to tiny debriefing the incident appendix V scientific briefing. Once the xenomorph population reaches a critical environmental mass, we judged somewhere between a thousand and two thousand base living units in the hive pheromones change. What we call spreading begins as the young queens search out new territories. This is the normal state of affairs. Of course, should the Empress die or even abdicate if such a thing were possible, one of the young queens would have to replace her. One can only imagine the fury and storm generated by such an instinctive and violent urge. And we have to locate our team. Too bad we can't use the exosuit anymore and we're down to pistol and knife. Awesome. But now we have access to our flashlight again, which is a good thing. Oh sh... So that's where we come from and we can't get up here again see it's sort of an invisible wall so let's see a lot of steam well, there seems to be an opening okay Careful, that's a big fucker. Oh. Oh, well, that was not a good idea. Out of ammo? Shit. What 
do I get? Is there any? Yes. Okay. Ah, shit. Forget the rocket launcher. Okay. Just try to get in a few shots. Where is that big gun? I still don't have it apparently. What is that here? Hell yes, the minigun. What's that? Hello? Game? Apparently the game crashed on me. Let's try again, shall we? The problem is that you can't rely solely on... ...on the minigun. Because you don't have enough ammo for that. Hey, you're still alive, that's good. Where is the minigun? Here. No, but it's supposed to be somewhere around here. Yeah. Okay, I don't have much effect. I just still don't have the fucking minigun. Where is it? It was ri lying around here somewhere. Seeing it though. Hello, minigun? Oh, shit. You gotta be kidding me, man. Tell me if you see it. Shit. Flame throw. Really? Well, I have to do this with the flamethrower. That's the weird. Oh, the flamethrower is out. Um, still no smart gun. Where, I mean, minigun. Where is it? I thought it was. I'm not seeing it. No fucking idea. Oh well. Then we do it without the minigun. Leave me in peace. Ow! Okay.
What do we have here? Smart components. That's good, though. Hell yeah. Um, gotta go. It's weird that I wasn't able to find a minigun again. Maybe I overlooked it. Probably. Coming for you. You'll pass on the data to my father. You can give it to him yourself. We're airborne now. Get clear then. Hurry. What are you talking about? I'm on my way. No time. Don't give up, Tomiko. You hear me? They're not going to save this place. I won't let them. Whatever you're doing, stop. Get to the landing bay. What's your first name anyway? Andrew. Take care, Andrew. Tomiko out. Tomiko. Tomiko! I'm reading power spikes off the scale. Hold on, everyone. Tomiko. And that, my friends, was the Marine campaign. So the Marines responded to a distress call. They came to help. They got fucked over by almost everybody. They lost a lot of men. And then they left. And if you want to know what really happened on that planet, you have to play in the Predator and the Alien campaign as well. We will be doing that in another video. So thank you very much for watching and see you soon. Bye.